hey you guys so my first time vlogging on this camera well on my phone camera let me turn this heater off y'all i hear you like on my skin we're gonna go in the bathroom here and i'm gonna show y'all some stuff i've been doing to increase my self-care no reset my self-care and just get back to me get back to whatever i used to be before I felt like a shell of myself. Um, so y'all, everything's going okay. A lot better than I was a couple of weeks ago. I mean, my anxiety levels were high. We are in the midst of moving JB to a private school. I want her to hear up and get back with me. <laughs> um, and you know, it, it's been interesting. So um, the school that he's currently in, y'all, it's a very new school. It's gotten to the point to where I've had a discussion with the principal because, um, but it is what it is. You know, I feel so bad for these teachers. And if you think about it, these kids have not had a stable environment of, you know, education in three years. Excuse me, I'm spitting. In three years. But that does not mean that you get a pass for showing your ass out in classroom. Because, y'all, look, the last straw, it's funny now because we moving him the hell out. The last straw for me was when I went to go pick up JB a couple of days ago, there was a, hold on, y'all. Okay. There was a child that had escaped onto the playground. There were no teachers around. This, I think he was like preschooler because they do preschool out here. It um, starts at the public schools. Preschooler, four years old. He had escaped onto the playground. He had stripped down naked, was at the very top of the playground, dancing around playing. So the parents, some of us parents had to um, let the teachers know, like one parent, she was like, hey, do y'all see this child? I was like, oh my God. <sighs> so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and spend all this, money we made from this house basically not all of it but it's gonna be pricey i'm too embarrassed to even tell y'all how much it costs i mean if you're familiar with private schools you know that it starts off at between eight to nine thousand it starts off and can go up to fifteen thousand look at this purse girl look at this purse this was a present to me while i was still in phoenix i don't even know if y'all saw, saw this look at this this is bad i'm gonna put this over here so this is what the um formal dining room is looking like i know i got a lot of candles up here i'm still working on what i want this to be it's coming together coming together so we have recycle coming and over here i have like little setup going on over here i think i'm gonna do this differently over here y'all have to ignore this trash but yeah this is what it looks like let me back up so you come in here let me show you you see boom Go, go, boom, boom, orange, brown, red. Yeah, neutral tones. Like, oh, girl, you got some chicken. What's going on here? So, yeah, just getting this to kill the, getting it all to kill the. All right, so I got to make a phone call after this to the um, school, y'all. Over here on this side of my face, I'm breaking out in almost like hives or something every now and then. Yeah, so. I've been keeping up with my skin regimen, as you can tell. Um, but I'm gonna link in the cards what I put, what I use on my skin. Um, good molecules. I have a couple of face serum. One of my subscribers got me caught up on that, and I've been hooked ever since. Ever since, excuse me. Um, moisturize my face. Be careful what I eat. Make sure I'm drinking water. So, I'm going to also flat twist my hair, y'all, while I'm back here because my husband just told me that we're going out tomorrow. <sighs> Who is this messaging me? Christine. Okay. So, as I stated in my chit chat video a couple of weeks ago, I have started back making me a priority and getting myself together. Uh, now, this morning... I didn't eat that well. <laughs> um, I need to drink some more water today. I definitely need to drink some water. I have a gallon of water in the car. I need to take that out and drink that. I'm trying to think about what I'm going to have for dinner. Y'all get so busy and I get so wrapped up in doing tasks. Again, like I said, my life has been just very transactional. So dinner, 
I started stretching every morning again. I get up five o'clock every morning. I know that's super early, but that's me time. And I also start work that early sometimes. I get up, I do my stretches, I pray, I meditate. Um, I go through my to-do list, figure out what I have to do for the day, for the week, etc. cetera. Um, I also uh, get JV stuff ready for school, okay? I make sure that I wash my face, do what I need to do. I put on workout clothes even though I'm not gonna work out. <laughs> I started back working out this week. Baby steps, okay? Um, but one of the first things I also started doing was getting my skin, like I said, getting my skin back together. What well, your skin is not just your face, but your overall body. Um, exfoliating, moisturizing, baby. It's just not warming up. But those of you who live out here, especially in Texas, you know, it, even, you know, this Arctic storm, storm affected everybody. So what I was doing until I got my oils in, because typically I use for my skin, I don't really use lotion. For 20 plus years, I've been using oils. And so I typically use sweet almond oil, but I didn't have that. So what I was using was this combination. So I would slather my body in lotion and then seal it in with this cocoa butter healing jelly. When I tell you this stuff smells divine, mm, it smells so good. And my skin was extremely soft. Also going in and using my exfoliating brush, brush two to three times a week. Okay, my feet, I told y'all, those feet were like, girl, Bigfoot, like, I felt like I was walking around with no shoes for the past 50 years. Like, get it together, Vivian. So, going in, scrubbing my feet, using a stone, okay? And then I have this nifty difty thing I got from Amazon. <laughs> Bomb.com. All over my feet. And then I wear socks every day anyway because it's cold inside the house. Slather my feet with... Um, not this, but with petroleum jelly, Vaseline, and put some socks on. My husband likes my feet soft too. Yes. Now I do need to get myself a manicure here soon. Um, so yeah. So let me show y'all. This is so embarrassing, but this is part of life. I mentioned it's been almost two months now that I had to have two teeth pulled in the back here. You can see that. And I already have one tooth missing here. That's not cute. Okay, that, that's just not cute at all. So I have partial dentures. Now, there are like three different alternatives you can get for missing teeth. Um, partial dentures is what suits my pocketbook at the moment. And also, dental implants can be very dangerous if not done right. But even if they are done correctly, a dental implant. And a dental implant, implant actually consists of three different parts. And the thing that I was a little concerned about is... Um, as far as FDA complaints, the most number one complaint comes from dental implants and, and breast implants, actually. And so I didn't want to go down that path of having issues with a dental implant. So look, if you don't want to see this, if this, if this types of stuff grosses you out, skip it right now. So I'm going to show you what the dental implant looks like and I'm going to put it in. So since I'm missing... Actually, I'm missing one tooth over here and two teeth over here. So this one, though, shows up the most because I'm not used to that. So this is what the dental implant looks like. Okay, I got them in. I'm going to be talking funny, but look. Pretty freaking seamless. I mean, I talk like I have a speech impediment. Now, I cannot eat with these in. Um, they move around. But this is for as... <laughs> y'all this is for taking pictures see aesthetically i mean i'm pretty sure if i kept them in longer i could learn how to talk with them in but yeah but i have to be careful with them too because they can break so i probably should wear these every day you know what i mean i just don't want people talking to me and they're like hey can you pass me the creamer i'm like okay i'll give you the creamer what the hell girl <laughs> Text you, girl, Miss Delightful. I miss you. I miss your videos. Rhonda, you, yeah, Rhonda is another um, YouTuber. Her YouTube name is Miss Delightful. She's from Louisiana, so she's my cousin. Um, I like her and her crazy ass sister. Hey, Nikki. I know that's not, that's your nickname. It's so funny because that's my sister's, um, that's what we call my sister, Nikki. 
Oh yeah, I'm gonna do my makeup. I know my I know it looks like I have makeup on. I actually have just a little bit, but I'm gonna beat the hell out of my face. Our first time going out as a family. It's supposed to be Valentine's Day family. Thank you, boo. So we're going to the ranch out in Las Colinas. So yeah, I need to do some more. So I'm gonna be using the Morphe palette. About I don't know who. Um I need to do a little bit more popping with the shimmer. Ooh, I'm going to show you what I'm wearing. And the weather is supposed to be different later on today. So we shall see. Let me go in with some more. Maybe it's Maybelline. Yeah, I wear basic cover girl. So funny. The girls at the office in the front office at our apartment that we used to live in in Phoenix, they, were, they always said, what do you use on your face? The key to any great facial appliance is good skin you have to have good skin you know what i mean because who was that that was wearing even though she's beautiful but when sometimes when she would wear makeup it would look horrible because her skin was horrible kenya you know kenya from real housewives of atlanta she would have like pepperoni pizza i'm gonna add a little bit of shimmer yes cheekbones on point look at that That's it. I'm done. Let's do these eyes, girl. That's what we're really going to focus on. And let me get... <sighs> so, how y'all doing this Friday? Are y'all ready for the... What do you call it? Y'all. You guys. Um, even though I am a Southern girl by heart, I don't do football. I really don't. I don't know anything about football. Uh, uh, I, I hate sports overall. There's no sports that I like. I mean, ice skating is cute. Um, besides that, I don't do sports. I don't do football, which is blasphemy if you're from Texas. Um, well, I tell you, these folks have been getting on my nerves out here. Everywhere I go, they have a little football section with jerseys and stuff. Because, I mean, sports is really big. JB, if y'all hear something, JB's room is literally on the other side of this wall. So, he's in there recording something, child. He said he needs to record his old school collection. Y'all, he has so many other posters coming in. When I tell y'all I have an old soul, baby, he has a Michael Jackson poster coming in. A Good Burger poster. Y'all remember Good Burger? Good Burger poster coming in. And something else. I don't know. He's so excited for that Good Burger poster, though. He loved Good Burger. I think I want to smoke that out a little bit more. It's not as smoky as I want it. I need to call Angel. Y'all want to talk about someone who has dropped that beautiful Angel to me, uh, Nezzy Naps, a YouTuber. Angel is absolutely stunning, you guys. She is beautiful to me. Yeah, I'm hungry. I probably need to eat a banana before we go. Because I don't want to get there and just eat a bunch of food and then get sick and be drinking. You know what I mean? I haven't eaten anything. This is what I'm talking about. I got to take care of myself. I look way too... Something's off. I'll fix it in a minute. I don't like hair on my face, so I did a little mini pompadour. I'll show the back. Girl, what is going on with the... Mind you, my hair is about three weeks old. Yeah. We're going to put on these pants, and I'll show y'all my whole outfit, okay? I really don't need a lot of support. Uh, This is what that looks like to me. So, I think I'm going to go with these green because it'll pop up the green that's in here. But then I also have these. I think I'm... It's not going to be a high of 78. Um, let me put them on. I need to buy a long mirror. Heck. Uh, yeah, I'm going to wear these. Okay. Girl. Girl, 
Hey y'all, it's Sunday. It's Super Bowl Sunday. Girl, look, I told y'all, I think I told y'all, I don't know anything about football. Matter of fact, I had my coworker, Christine, try to explain to me about, you know, football. And she, she asked me, what did you ask me, girl? She asked me, okay, so are people in Dallas, are there fans of the Houston team? I'm like, wait a minute, there's another team? There's another football team. Let me tell you all something. Okay, so I explained to her how I thought this thing works, the Super Bowl, Super Bowl football thing work. I thought that each state had their own representative, kind of like a uh, the USA beauty pageant. <laughs> I'm not shitting you. So I excuse my language. I thought each state had their own team. I mean, yeah, I know there's other teams as far as like college football. But I didn't know Houston had a football team, like an NFL football team. I honestly didn't know that. All I know is the Dallas Cowboys. So she's like, wait, you really don't know anything about football. No, Christine. I told your ass, I don't. I didn't even know. Look, I actually went on to look up different players. I didn't know you had all those different type of players. I thought that. I mean, I know there's like a, a running back, a kicker, a quarterback, a quarter, whatever. I'm not trying to be stupid. I really don't know. But I thought that if you had a good kicker, they're also supposed to be like do other stuff too. But there's like eight or nine different, like, there's eight, there's like a bunch of different playing. I'm not even going to talk about this. So anyway, it's Super Bowl Sunday. I am going to cook some appetizers because we've been eating out a lot, y'all. So we're still trying to get settled in. Oh, I'm going to tell y'all I am done. Um, So let me just tell you, I'm going to cook. I'm going to cook, cook some appetizers, girl. I'm going to make chicken taquitos. I'm going to make um, Jamaican jerk chicken wings. Um, what am I talking about that? Bean and corn dip. And then guacamole and a coconut cake. That is it. Like, cause it's just me, my husband, and Jamie. Jamie don't eat any of that either. Yesterday we had the floors cleaned, uh, the carpet cleaned. Because when I tell you, my husband's allergies have still been horrible, and we think it's a, a number of things. We we probably should have had the carpet cleaned before we moved into the house. We got that done um, yesterday, and I just look. My mom is coming next weekend, which I'm really excited for. But I'm going to need one weekend where we ain't doing nothing because I am tired. We have literally been done, done, done doing something for like since May of last year. And I am, I'm getting burnt out, y'all. So, yeah, we're going to have to get to a stopping point. And I'm going to have to talk to him this morning and be like, babe, I am tired. So don't plan anything. Don't do, I don't want to do shit. Like, um, so girl, let me fill out this paperwork. Oh, Lord, hey. Armpit temperature. Girl, I gotta buy the baby school's um, uniforms because this place, um, I can still use his bottoms, his khakis. Because he has, there's a dress code at the school he goes to now, but they can wear polo shirts. Here, you have to get the school logo shirts. And I think we, I'm, well, I, don't think I know we made the right decision to I know we are making the right decision rework that to move him to this school because when we went to go tour the school the um administrator was like do y'all live in Devonshire and we looked at my husband and I looked at each other like yeah she's like she's like yeah we've had some people coming from that area wanting to um tour the schools it's really hard to vlog on this camera and once I pay off this car and once I get my money situation up to par, I'm definitely going to have to go ahead and get a, get a new camera because I can't, I can't be vlogging on my, on my camera. I can't record on here like I want to. It's just not going to work. I can't zoom in. You know what I mean? I can't. So let me stop complaining. Um, I hope y'all doing okay. Okay.